Hi everyone, Miss Amanda here from the Plain City Public Library. Normally, this time of year, I would be visiting your classrooms to read you some books and tell you all about the summer reading program. This year, since you're all schooling from home, I decided to make a video instead. Our summer reading program is called Imagine Your Story this year, and what better way to use your imagination than by reading a book? The summer reading program starts June 8th and challenges you to keep reading over the summer. And it's very important that we all keep reading over the summer. Just like playing baseball or riding your bike, you only get better at reading when you practice. So to encourage you to keep reading over the summer, the library has lots of fun programs and prizes for you. Not sure what to read? We have lots of great new books that you can request online and pick up at the library. You can also contact me at the library for recommendations. Here are a few of the great new books that we have at the library right now. Ballet Ball is about a girl named Nini who loves ballet, but ballet is over for the year. Now it's time for baseball. Nini doesn't want to give up her tutu for a ball glove, but mom signed her up, so she's stuck. The coach tries to get her to pay attention. Her teammates ask her to do her part. Just as Nini's team might lose again, she realizes that ballet and baseball have more in common than she thought. Maybe change isn't so bad after all. Ballet Ball is written by Erin Dion and illustrated by Jillian Flint. The Box Turtle, written and illustrated by Vanessa Roeder, is about a turtle named Terrence. When Terrence was born, he had he was a little different from the other turtles, but he didn't mind. He loved his box. Until, that is, someone points out that his warm and cozy box is a little, well, weird. And so Terrence begins a quest to see if there is a better shell out there for him. Have you read Thelma the Unicorn? Then you won't want to miss this fabulous sequel written and illustrated by the author of Pig the Pug and the Bad Guys, The Return of Thelma the Unicorn by Aaron Blavy. The world misses its favorite unicorn, but Thelma is reluctant to don her horn and sparkles again. However, with the support of her best friend Otis, she realizes the importance of spreading love and joy, no matter what people think. Pete the Cat fans, you'll want to check out our newest Pete book, Pete the Cat's Family Road Trip. Buckle up and grab your snacks. Pete the Cat and his family are heading off on a super fun road trip. There are so many sights to see and things to do all over the United States, like seeing Niagara Falls and dancing in the streets in New Orleans. They travel everywhere from Savannah to San Francisco. This book is a beginner reader, guided reading level J, written by Kimberly Dean and illustrated by James Dean. Have you read a Jack book yet? You won't want to miss these beginning readers all about Jack. Jack is a good guy, but he can also be bad. For example, in this book, Jack works in a lab. Jack makes more Jacks. Those Jacks go wild. How will you stop them, Jack? Find out in Too Many Jacks, written by Mac Barnett and illustrated by Greg Pizzoli. If you're a dog lover, you won't want to miss the latest from best-selling author and author of A Dog's Purpose, W. Bruce Cameron, Lily to the Rescue. Lily lives with her girl, Maggie Rose. Once a stray, Lily was rescued by the kind people at the animal shelter run by Maggie Rose's mom. Now she has a very important purpose, to rescue other animals in trouble. Manana Land, an award-winning author, Pam Munez Ryan, is about courage and self-discovery. Maximiliano Cordoba loves stories, especially the legend Buelo tells him about a mythical gatekeeper who can guide brave travelers on a journey into tomorrow. With a treasured compass, a mysterious stone rubbing, and Buelo's legends as his only guides, he sets out on a perilous quest to determine if he is true of heart and what the future holds. If you're a fan of Timmy Failure, you probably already know about the Timmy Failure movie on Disney Plus. But did you know about the new prequel, Timmy Failure Zero to Hero? 
Find out just how Timmy became the greatest detective in the world in this new book written and illustrated by Stefan Pastis. It's easy to get books at the library, even when we're closed. Your parents can find out how by visiting our COVID-19 update page at plaincitylib.org slash COVID-19. We also have some great programs scheduled this summer. On June 8th, the first day of the summer reading program at two o'clock, the library is hosting an online sing-along concert with singer-songwriter Joni Kalem. This concert will be on Facebook Live, YouTube, and Twitter. We also have virtual magic shows, animal programs, and more, all online that you can watch from home. You can check them all out on our website. Back to the summer reading program, we would like to challenge you to read for 12 hours over the summer. That's about 15 minutes each day. You can get a reading log to help keep track of your reading at the library or by visiting our website, plaincitylib.org SRP. You don't even have to sign up this year. Just grab a reading log and start reading. You'll chart your time spent reading all summer long. And when you're done, you'll get a prize. We have narwhal and unicorn rubber duck squirters, magic wands, and puzzle cubes to choose from if you are in preschool through sixth grade. The first 50 kids who finish the summer reading program will also win a $5 gift card to Jan and Tony's Pizza. And every kid who finishes the summer reading program will get a free ice cream cone from Lil E's. Everyone who finishes the summer reading program will also have a chance to win our grand prize, a Kindle Fire Kids Edition. We also have a summer reading program for teens and adults, so tell your older brothers and sisters and parents that they can win a lot of great prizes too. I hope you all participate in the summer reading program this year. If you have any questions, visit our website, plaincitylib.org SRP, or send me an email at awarner at plaincitylib.org, and I will be happy to answer your questions. Thank you, everyone. I hope you have a great summer.